Right, the postman has been, and it looks like Artec have sent me something. I don't know what it is. Uh, it's a box, that's as much as I know. Uh, I did know they were sending me a box, but they would not tell me what was in it. Top secret, I'm told. So that's all rather exciting. So all I can tell is it's a pretty big box and it's fairly heavy. And it says Artec on it, that's all I know. So let's have a look. <laughs> This looks like a nice machine. It looks like a welder. It looks like a very compact, very, very swish interface welder. This is MIG 181 from Artec Welding, featuring easy setup and a brand new high clarity LCD display. What a bit of kit it is. Turn on and get welding with professional welds in three simple clicks in 15 seconds. So here we are, here's the machine, and with all our set machines, they come in the box with everything you need to run straight away. So it comes with a torch, a uh, Euro torch, it comes with the earth lead, which I always think our set leads are really good quality, they're a nice proper rubber. Uh, they just feel durable, they don't feel cheap and plasticky like the other machines. They come for gas regulator and the hose that goes straight on the machine. Quite often when you buy welders, they'll come. You then have to go to any welding supplies to get one of these. And then you find that you get some hose and that doesn't go on the back of the machine because it's slightly different fixing or it's European or, or whatever. You don't have that problem part so Everything comes with it to get you, you running. You could send one of these to a job site, order it from Artec, send it to a job site, turn up and use it. The MIG-181 can be used with 6 and 8mm MIG wire. You can also use flux cord wire, so you can be used gasless, and it will do stick welding MMA as well. The machine boasts a maximum material thickness of 6mm, and all the preset modes are set by Artec themselves, so all you have to do is select the thickness, and it will set the settings perfectly for you every time. The machine is light and small in size, so it's perfect for taking the job site, putting in the car or the van. Time to have a closer view at the control panel on the welder. So this welder can get welding in three clicks. You can be welding in 15 seconds. So we turn on the back. This LCD screen lights up with all of our modes. And then using this arrow here, we select our wire thickness from 0.6, 0.8, it's already set, 0.8. This arrow here, we can set our material thickness. And it's got all the useful sizes, 0 0.8, 1 mm, 1 1.2, 1 1.5, 2, 2.5, 3, 3.5 and, and 4. We'll set it to 3, that's flashing there. We're ready to go. Hit the torch, we're welding. Now if you don't want it to work out the parameters for you, you can press this button here, easy setup on and off. So that's off, we can now set our wire and our bolts manually. Now if we just turn the potentiometer like that, you get increments of 0.1. However, if you push it in and turn it, it'll turn up a whole division. So that's nice and easy. Turn our easy mode back on. It sets it for us, but you can fine tune it with the knobs. Over here, we can select what sort of welding we're doing. So we've got 95% argon mix, 8% argon mix. So if you change that, it'll change the parameters. Flux cord wire for if you're welding outside of MIG welding, and MMA, stick welding. Now in MMA, you can change your bolts and your amps using the two knobs. If we put it into easy setup, we can select with the left arrow our electrode diameter, with the right arrow our work thickness. Right, here we go. So we have two pieces of one millimeter mild steel. So we set the machine, our wire diameter is 0.8, that's already done, and then we set the uh, work thickness to one mil, and then it gives us 4.4 meters per minute of wire and 16.4 volts. Snip our uh, wire, and we should be ready to go. Give it two tacks, and then uh, go for a run. If the argument is, go that way. One tack. 
Not burnt through. I could have been straighter. We've got full penetration. Pretty good. I then proceeded to do Two various plate, test welds on together. different pieces of plate right up to the 6 more capacity and this machine has plenty of power, plenty of grunt, nice smooth welds, just click the button, set the material thickness and the machine does the rest. It really is a joy to weld with. There's plenty of power in this machine, and that's 6 mil plate, and that's not going anywhere. Right, let's have a bit of a go for stick arc welding capability. So we'll go over here, drop the setting over to stick welding, and we've got 4 millimeters uh, rod, and then material thickness 5 millimeter. It's actually 6 millimeter, but that's about as much as it goes. We've got volt 75, so that's the highest starting voltage, so it gets a good clean arc. Then it drops it down to a working voltage, and then amps are set to 145. There it goes. Very quiet. I then set about using the welder to do general everyday MIG welding tasks. That's often the best way to test a piece of equipment, do with it what you normally do. And the welder performs faultlessly. Uh, it really is very easy to get on with. I have to say Artec, I'm very impressed with this machine. I've used uh, smart welders before, or memory welders, never really got on with them. But this isn't a memory welder, this is a welder with easy setup, set up by a company that know what they're doing. You press the button and it does exactly what you want it to do. It delivers the same quality of welding wherever you are. Great machine, love it. I'm going to enjoy using this one.